Melvin is certainly one of the happiest people I've ever met. And it's an inspiration, I think, to everybody. Everybody loves Melvin, and M Melvin loves everybody else. And he comes every day early, sets up for me for mass, puts the wine in the chalice, gets the water ready, puts the hosts out, gets the towel out and the, and the bowl, and uh, then he serves mass for me. Um, does a little bit more at St. Dominic's when we have mass there than when we're at St. John's just because of the setup of the chapel. And then he distributes communion every day. Then he cleans up, usually every day, too. So, I mean, he, he's really doing a lot of the support. I don't even have to worry about it. It's, 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 so, it's, so he, it's just part of, part, of, part of my service, that's all. I don't mind serving it. Okay. I, do it I do it of my own volition, and that's it. The I to him and became Catholic because I liked the solemnity of the church, and I and I had uh, I watched the, the the people who were worshiping me, and they were so involved in, 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 in into the service, and I liked that their attentiveness and their and their, 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 their I just felt that feeling that they were into it. I was 12, 12 years old at that time, 88 years. I've become a Catholic.